Ron Cabillo, his weekly column for small newspapers came out this morning. So now we find out, he writes, that NBC News wants to hire Rosie O'Donnell as a show host. And thus, in desperation, NBC News has turned to Ms. O'Donnell. Yeah, Bill doesn't keep up with the news much. And don't give me that stuff about how columns have long lead times and the whole story only changed last night. It was still up on his website till 3 this afternoon, and it's still up on the website of his biggest outlet, humanevents.com. Bill, I keep telling you, you have to stop believing everything you read in the damned liberal New York Times. Runner-up, Billo. The things you learn on the web. The O'Reilly Christmas store is now open online. Clearance discounts. Culture warrior doormats. We're $39.95, now $17.95. Bill O'Reilly jigsaw puzzles. We're $14.95. Your price, $4.95. Now you know what that's about. The jigsaws are actually a few pieces short of a puzzle, just like the guy they depict. But our winners in an amazing trifecta. Fixed news, discredited Clinton accuser Kathleen Willey, and lunatic fringe talk show host Mad Melanie Morgan. Willey claims that her two cats were murdered by Senator Clinton. She says that after her first cat vanished, somebody pretending to be a jogger came up to ask her about the cat by name. Then it happened after her next cat disappeared, too. Then, Melanie Morgan told Willie she knew all about it, that a private investigator had once, quote, all but admitted to her that he'd killed the cats on Hillary's orders. And all this was repeated this morning on Fox Noise, including this memorable summary from Brian Kilmeade, quote, but it didn't stop there. Does the name Fluffy mean anything to you? Do you people do nothing but sit there and smoke dope all day? Fox Noise, Kathleen Willey, and Melanie Morgan, today's worst persons in the world.